John here, autograph fisherman, and I have a very special uh, thank you video for Lisa. No chance in H E double hockey sticks. Am I going to be able to pronounce your last name? Uh, she left an amazing comment in my last video, and that was I do not know any hockey players, but I watch your videos. Uh, because not only do you show the uh, player, but you talk about them, like the video. Thanks for sharing, and thank you for that comment. That meant a lot to me. The second big time shout out is to Card Wolves. Uh, Card Wolf, um, you mentioned that you liked my t shirts. Here's my Kid Rock t-shirt. Um, but beyond that, uh, you gave me a chance to share my extremely big uh, part in life, big thing in life, and that's my kids. Uh, I really enjoy both of those channels. As soon as I get a notification for those channels, I watch them as soon as I get a chance to. So getting ready into, oh, I'm going to put links um, in the description to both of those channels. Hope you guys are watching. I know I'll be watching your next video. So featured player for Lisa is going to be a baseball player. Probably going to be one of, only one this year. I was going to plan on, okay, I did plan on doing this much later, probably in the summer. But I fast-forwarded my plans to do it today for you, Lisa. And that is Johnny O, who's upside down. Johnny O, John Erlud. He was born in August 5th, 1968. He played 1989 to 2005 with Toronto Blue Jays, New York Mets, Seattle Mariners, New York Yankees, and uh, Boston Red Sox. He was part of the back-to-back -back World Series champs with the Jays in 92 and 93. I watched both of those games and I was addicted to uh, baseball from that moment on. He's a two-time All-Star win winner. Um, he won the baseball uh, batting title in uh, 93 and finished runner-up in 98. He won three Gold Glove Awards. In 1999, he appeared in a cover of uh, Sports Illustrated. And it was titled, as a question, the best infielder ever. Alongside with, and I, I really suck at names, but I'll try my best. A great, a great Alfonso, Ray Ortiz, and Robin Viterra when he uh, played for the Mets. <clears throat> Excuse me. In seventeen seasons, he played in two thousand two hundred and thirty-four games with a on-base percentage of 9 point, uh, uh, sorry, 3.98. It would have been amazingly crazy if it was 9 point something, but he had 500 doubles, 255 home runs, and 1,230 RBIs, and he was hit by 88 pitches. He is one of only 26 players to hit for the cycle. Uh, for those people watching who don't know what the cycle is, that's a base hit, double, triple, and home run in the same game. Now, besides all of that amazing stuff, um, he was really known for wearing a helmet, a batting helmet on the field. And that was because he suffered a suffered a aneurysm at the age of twenty, 
So he had to wear a helmet all the time. So that was uh, John Irwin for you. Only baseball you're going to probably see this year, unless I get a return. I have sent one to Juan Guzman and Joe Carter. If I happen to get those back, I'll feature those players. But I'm a hawk. I'm Canadian. Love my hockey. So thank you, Lisa, for that comment, and thank you, Carter Wolf, for those amazing uh, detailed. Uh, I have to say, it, it was a detailed shout, shout out, and I really enjoyed that. That really touched me down deep. So, uh, descriptions of those channels in the, uh, uh, links to those channels in the description. And I hope you like, share, and subscribe. Till next time, keep on collecting. Bye.